Good afternoon, this is Eric Windheim, building biologist and electromagnetic radiation specialist. We're at a house with solar, and you can see the dirty electricity here, and the client has had many health irritations and problems since the solar was installed. So they got a device called a uh, sign tamer, and they had that installed. So we're testing to see what it does. Currently, this is the solar only no Stetzer filters, no sign tamer. So we see that we're getting uh, about 3.7, uh, 3, 372 millivolts peak to peak. <clears throat> so I'm going to go outside and turn the sign tamer on. Please also notice we're getting 330 on the Stetzer meter. I'll be back in a minute. I'm going to turn the sign tamer on and see how much of a drop we get. Okay, did you see any change? A little bit. Okay, yeah, it's down from 360 down to 283. Mm -hmm. It was 360. It's down to 283. And the amplitude is slightly less. So I'm going to pull this down here. Okay, so we're at 355 millivolts. Now, the Stetzer filter has brought it down to 82. Right. Without any filter of any kind, the dirty electricity was 360 here on the Stetzer meter. So 360 is what we have with solar on and no filters. 280 is what we have with solar on and the sign tamer. 82 on the Stetzer meter is what we have when the Stetzer filters are on, the solar is on, and the sign tamer is not on. So for some reason this, the sign tamer is not doing very much at all. And uh, not enough to help the client from being symptomatic. Is, is that what you would say? Yes. Okay. So we're going to uh, have the client talk to the manufacturer of the sign tamer and see if there's some explanation for this. Thank you very much. That's all for now.